strike under the line! Well, I was a history major at the time. I was in grad school. Oh, yeah. Call. I love baseball. I love history and decided, up. you know what? I wonder if I can put the two together. And I found the Athletic Baseball Club of Philadelphia. I saw that they played by 1864 and other 19th century rules. You got to run. You got to run. Wore period appropriate clothing. And I decided to give it a go. You're up team was founded because guys saw a news broadcast of vintage baseball being played elsewhere and thought this sounds like a really cool idea let's try it out teams from across the country travel a lot and you grow quite a network uh, in vintage baseball and it becomes kind of a fraternity uh, amongst players and it's it's really cool to see warning batter we play approximately 12 to 13 dates a year like this one here at the Camden Historical Society. We've been here three years. We've played other historical societies and historic sites throughout the year. We've noticed groups of boys playing bass, a certain game of ball. They'll be playing an 1864 rules game today. First and foremost, obviously there's no gloves, which means that stealing is the name of the game. Balls caught on one bounce qualify as an out, in addition to balls caught on the fly. Runners may not overrun first base safely. And fair ball is determined on where the ball lands first. This team is great. They're really great guys. One hand. They're really into the history. We make our own balls. Um, I'm actually the one that makes our balls. Pitcher, you are worn. There's a rubber core, some yarn around it, and then the leather cap with the stitching. It's a lemon peel ball. It has one stitch throughout. I love the fact that we don't use gloves because all you need is a bat and a ball. Give the old man some gas. And you know, you can jam a finger or two, but for the most part, you get used to it. Air ball. Uh, today it is the Elizabeth Resolutes versus the Philadelphia uh, Athletics. It's a gentleman's game. The camaraderie, um, the friendships that you build playing this game are amazing. They're all great people, you know, and it's baseball. Who doesn't love baseball? I'd like to thank the spectators that came out and watched. Thank you. We can't continue to move forward without remembering our past, right? It's, it's a big, important part um, of who we are. Hip, hip! Hurrah! Hip, hip! Hurrah! Hip, hip! Hurrah! Hurrah! So I just want to keep doing it for as long as I can and be historically accurate. And the more teams, the better, you know? Great game. Great game.